Hi everyone, so I'm very excited for this video because I am going to follow uh, <laughs> what I am going to do I tried following Nikki Tutorials tutorial specifically um, I'm trying to follow her Perry Edwards shout out to my ex inspired makeup tutorial so I think today it's gonna be quite challenging because um, it has a cut crease and eyeliner all those things that I've never done before so it's gonna be funny I guess so let's get on to it I'm gonna be using this one by MAC. So Nikki Tutorials, um, Nikki, she uses like foundation and all in the video which I don't own any. I don't own any foundation, I only use the Laneige BB Cream and my Wake Me Up Concealer. So I'm just gonna do my base, my own base without following hers. So let's start. Okay, so my base as I think y'all, if y'all watch my simple makeup tutorial, um, you all should know that my base is quite simple. I don't use foundation. I, um, I'm not all about the heavy, full coverage um, girls. So yeah, also I don't own any beauty blenders. <laughs> I just find that you know, beauty blenders are so expensive, especially those in Sephora. I got a comment from the previous um, makeup tutorial that this um, anonymous lah, she just like quoted what I said before, I said, she quoted, she was like, I don't use foundation. Then she said, laws that you sis. Damn, like, <laughs> BB cream are very light uh, and not as full coverage as foundation. So, yeah. And now I'm going to set my under eye area with powder to prevent it from creasing. So what she's doing is she's baking her under eyes and once again, I know. I don't bake my under eyes because I think some of you girls might feel me that once you bake your under eyes, it will look very bright. That it makes your eye look smaller. So my eyes really very small, so I don't want to make it look smaller. It works for many girls out there, and I, I'm really like jealous because I want to try baking, but I've tried it before and it doesn't work on me. So let's move on. One of the stuff just um Olympiad her uh, baby Johnson's powder, which I actually use at home. I use the pink one. So let's just um, use it all over my face. So in the video, she um, concealed her lids by using a concealer, which I already did. So let's move on. Okay, she's starting. Okay, so the first shade that she is using is from the Morphe palette. I'm not sure which one. I got a Morphe palette, but not hers. This is what is this? Three thirty five O. So she's using a, a brownish, um, medium brown kind of shade. So I think it is similar to this. So I'm just gonna take it with this brush by Zoeva. Okay, it's really letting out to look ugly. <laughs> I don't know what am I doing wrong. Why, why doesn't it look too heavy on this? You can do this. Because for my eye shape, I focus on my outer corner so it looks, you know, elongated something. So this is the complete opposite. Now hopping over to this shade right here for more definition but so Okay, she's using another shade of brown which is a lighter shade to create a softer definition so I'm guessing it's like it's this kind of colour which I already hit pen because it's a really nice colour okay, I think the difference is I'm using a really big brush I think so because she has like space like white space still but I'm really covering all my lid look at hers it looks damn nice what happened to mine? <laughs> What? What did I do wrong? I think our eyelid shade is a really completely different as well. Now with the darkest color of the palette, I'm going to define that inner crease even more. So now she's going in with a darker brown. So uh, it looks somehow like this one over here. She's using a smaller brush to define the crease even more. So I'm just going to dab a little bit and see. Oh my 
my god it's not blending no okay i think it's really the brush it's not my fault <laughs> oh my goodness it's a huge difference guys <laughs> She is cutting a crease using a really light shade of um, shimmer. It's like close to white. So I don't own the palette that she is using, but I found this kind of white shimmer, which is kind of similar. But I don't think it will work eh, because I already have like, a brown shade. So to be safe, I'm going to conceal my beads. Like, I'm going to cut the crease using the concealer first. So again, I'm taking the white shimmer, the whitest one here. Okay. <laughs> oh my god! Don't, it's a huge difference. Why? Hers looks so and neat and. That blend the same shade? Is it because it's of a different shape of shimmer? But it's the closest that I can find. Okay, maybe I'm gonna add a bit of this. Can you see it? Is it cut in crease? Um, kind of. Kind of, yeah. I'm gonna save it with this heavy metal Urban Decay liner. I don't know whether it's gonna work, but just to add a bit of shimmer. Taking this one and the darker one. It's okay. You can do. Okay, so she's using a cream eyeliner to um, line her under waterline. I don't know why, but like the whole of the waterline. So I'm using this one that I found in my mom's drawer. Like a goth, gothic. Oh, I t <laughs> okay. And then taking the darkest color from the crease again from the Morphe 35 M palette and smoking it okay, out. So she's um, blending the lower lash line out. So she's taking the darkest color from the crease and blending the liner. So I'm again. I'm gonna take the darkest brown here. Okay, now she's doing her eyeliner and I'm going to use this one by the the body shop. Um, she's using the same liquid liner as I am. It's the MAC Liquid Last Liner. So I'm just going to fill in the line that I did just now. Okay, now she is... Um, buffing the eyeliner um, shade out using a black um, eyeshadow but I don't own any black eyeshadow so I'm just gonna find the one closest to black which I think is this one wait is it? or is it this one? this one eh? so she's buffing it up upwards but I don't look good with like a liner kind of look so I'm just gonna smoke it out Oh my god, how does she do it? <laughs> For lashes, I'm gonna go in with one of my all time favorite styles. These are the Lily Lashes in the style Tease. Okay, now she is um, moving on to the lashes, and actually, I don't own any um, falsies. I used one yesterday and I lost it, so I'm just gonna um, use mascara and yeah. So now I'm using the mascara spider effect. This is not available in Singapore, but it's so good. Okay, so since she already did her brows, I am going to do my brows. So I'm using this by Australian Brows Dip. 
powder. God, I'm this. Diana Zin. I don't know any like Diana Zin. Since my natural brows is very straight, I'm going to conceal my brows to make it look um, to make it look a bit more up. This look is horrible. <laughs> I can't. For the little star, okay, now she's doing the star and the knees, the eyes, but I don't have any stars. You know, she's using the sticker kind, so I'm going to draw my star. I can't even draw a star on a piece of paper, so. So I'm using uh, an eyeliner by the workshop again. How do you draw a star? Oh. Okay, I'm drawing a heart, guys. I can't draw a star. Ah! <laughs> I'm ashamed. Does it look like that? Like that, like that more. All right. First for cheeks, let's do a little bit, and by a little, okay, so I mean now she's contouring. Her face. contouring. So she only focuses on the outer uh, part of her face, of her cheekbones. So. Just brush my <laughs> Number two. And this okay, is so the blusher. Bronzer. She's not using blusher. She's just warm. using the a lighter bronzer shade, which I don't have, to uh, represent blusher. But I'm just going to go in with some blusher to add a bit of color. Highlight. Go all out. Highlight. Go all out. She is known to be the highlight queen and I only no I only got this uh, very pigmented um, highlighter. Okay finally she's moving on to lipstick. Um she's using a very I don't know what shade is this. It's like a ro rosy shade of pink. But I'm just gonna go save and use a trusty old NSD. Um, lipstick uh, in the shade Megan Thee. Uh, setting spray? Okay. Setting spray. I don't have any setting spray. I only have my. Uh, I only use my sister's, but she's using it today, so I can't bring it here. If you guys understand that, so it's past now. I think that's about it. Yeah, yeah. But beginner's luck. I don't think I did so bad. So this is the finished look. So I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. So how guys? Brought to you by IU Apparels, Singapore's largest Muslima online store.